Hi guys! My name is Mary. This reading is for Leo. I hope everybody's doing great, feeling good. I'm not sure if you guys are aware, but my husband opened a new channel, Zenden Studios, that I help him with quite a bit. We get out into nature and enjoy it. You can find the description below if you're interested in it. Sometimes you just need to get away, right? We need nine of these, you guys. I want this one and this one. All right. One jumped out. Let's see what we got. <laughs> the sun card. Wowzy. That's nice. Beautiful card. Smack dab in the middle. Let me make sure it's in the middle. Ten of swords. That's all right. That's going away. The death card. See? That, there's the change right there. Two of Pentacles, Seven of Cups, Eight of Pentacles, Wheel of Fortune, Ten of Wands, you guys are working a lot, ain't you? And Justice. zoomed out on the camera so I could get them a little bit better. But I need them straight too. Okay, that's better. You're clarifying. Share the love. And choose a new direction. Ooh. Give me just a minute, okay? I'm almost feeling like you guys may have many different options that you guys are going to be able to pick and choose from. And when I, have, when I get this Seven of Cups over here, that's kind of what that tells me. It, they're going to be showing you uh, different cups that you're going to be able to pick and choose from. So basically, you all, you guys have probably heard me say this before, but in, in the long run, there's usually at least two of these cups, maybe three if you're lucky, that are, at, that are actually worth anything at this time for you. A lot of times... Uh, some of these cups can just be like too good to be true or you just want to say pooey on them and throw them over your shoulder or they're not right for you at this time. But every once in a while we get a little bit bogged down because we have too many options. And then we start thinking, should we go in this direction? Should we go in this direction? But you guys already know which way you're sh you should go and what you should do. I have two different tens here, a ten of swords and a ten of wands that basically just tell me that you guys are overworked, um, possibly underpaid, and you guys are just wearing yourselves plumb out. I do see this coming to an end, I'm going to tell you right now. This ten of wands, the death card right here, right beside it, it's coming to an end even if it, if, even if it didn't have the death, this ten of wands is an ending. So, especially with the death card here, and then the justice, for heaven's sakes, more balance, more feeling like that you're being treated fairly, and things like that. So, I just feel like there's something coming in for you all that you're going to be able to pick and choose from. So, whenever it says choose a new direction, sometimes it just means pay attention to all your opportunities, okay? So, I want to say that out loud. 
When I get this sun card smack dab in the middle, you guys probably already know that this is the be most beautiful card in the deck. It's the happiest card in the deck. And, it, and you guys are, go, are moving towards your happiness, your family's happiness, your job, or your business, I think is going to take off if that's the case, if you guys have your own business. Look at it this way, you all. I have this Eight of Pentacles, which could be your job, your career, your business, whatever you're doing uh, for a living that you're really, really good at. You've got the Sun card here, and then you've got the Justice. And you guys probably know, like I said earlier, the justice can either be more balance into your life or the justice can be you feel justified about something that's coming in that you guys have maybe been uh, not feeling like you, you're, you're not feeling it. There was something that's been going on in your life that just hasn't been on the up and up or that you guys have not felt like things are you've been treated fairly or that something is not... Uh, meshing the right way. So sometimes you all, this justice card could be like court cases and, and things that have to do with the court system. But every once in a while, when it comes around, it's about laws and rules and regulations and things that may be changing in your favor. Whenever I get the Justice card, I do feel like you are going to feel a lot better about a decision or about something that may be coming up or something that may be changing that's in your favor in one way or another. Now look at it this way. You've got this Wheel of Fortune, this Seven of Cups, and this Justice. Your, your fortune is changing. The wheel is spinning in your favor, okay? This is about new cycles, new chapters coming in, new um, experiences, basically. So you guys are about to re about ready to have some kind of new experience that's coming in. You just got to pick and choose which one is the best one for you. And when you see this Two of Pentacles over here, I think you guys are going to have two pretty good options. I'm going to be honest. I think you're going to be a little bit tickled with the options that you're going to have. And then with the um, with the Justice here too, like I said, it's just you know all about balance. But here is what you guys are aiming for. I feel like that maybe some of you all are in a little bit of a teeter-tottering mood or you're in a little bit of a should I or shouldn't I kind of situation. And whenever you get that way, sometimes you kind of, you almost argue with yourself sometimes or fight with yourself a little bit. And I believe that you guys are just getting to where you're just plumb wore out right here and you've had just about enough sticking and stabbing that you can deal with in your lifetime. So I think things are actually changing for you all. Look at it this way, you all. The sticking and stabbing is, is ending because you're, you're aiming for peace and happiness and, and all kinds of security and possibly even moving somewhere different, I'm going to say. Some of you all may be living in colder climates. You may be moving towards the sunnier climates, the warmer climates at this time. Um, some of you all may be considering going on vacation or traveling somewhere different. But some of you all, this is just your um, sanctuary, let's say, because that's how I feel. It's almost like, oh, you know what I mean? It's just you're feeling good about, about where you're about to be. You're feeling good about the way things are working out for you. And you're just feeling good. So I'm going to take a couple clarifying real quick, okay? I do believe if you guys are looking for a new job, for instance, it might be time for you guys to put in resumes. You might be getting um, options like you didn't expect for one reason or another. You know, sometimes as we get older, um, you might want to change your career or maybe just um, stick with what you know, but it might be a different title or a different um, option in different ways, if that makes any sense. Sometimes as we get older, we're just like, you know what? I don't want to do this anymore. I want to go way over here and do something completely different. So I believe a lot of you guys are on different tracks for different jobs or careers or even opportunities that's coming in for you. And I think you're going to be excited about what you guys may decide on. Um, I'm going to take a card real quick for that Ten of Swords. This one wants to come out. Two of Cups. How do you like that? Two of Cups. Give me just a minute, you all. I, 
I have a feeling you guys have a partner, whether this is a romantic partner, a business partner, a friendship, a brother, a sister, a family member, a parent, a child. There's you and someone else that the two of you guys are moving towards a new beginning in different ways. And the two of you guys may work together or, or are creating something together. And between the two of you all, you guys are, are moving into this new cycle, into this new wheel of fortune. It's almost like, um, it's almost like I feel like your luck is changing in a good way. So I, I believe this two of cups is important in your life at this time. So I'm going to leave that card there. I'm going to take one for this 10 of wands. Okay. I do believe that this, this death card is about change. You guys know that, right? I think you guys are, are dealing with some sort of change that's coming in. Um, it's probably not, um, a surprise for you all. And maybe that's where this choose a new direction is coming in. We also have the share of the love. Maybe the the two of cups is you guys. I don't know why, but for some reason I'm feeling like for maybe a handful of you guys, you guys may be dealing with the community. You may be doing something that is um, um, sharing with the community. Maybe you're donating to the community or having some sort of... Um, I mean, it could be for like clothing or food or homeless or something like that. Now, that may just be for a few of you all, but I feel strong about you guys helping other people rather than just yourself. I feel like it's, there's going to be other people that you guys are going to be helping. And I do believe that, there, that this death card here is regarding change and you guys moving in a new direction. The thing is, don't get bogged down, like I said earlier, with this Seven of Cups, because you're going to have a lot of options to choose from, and some of them just ain't good, you all. I'll be honest. Some of them ain't worth a hoot. You may as well just throw them away, throw them over your shoulder, and get rid of them, because um, sometimes they feel like they're too good to be true. Sometimes they feel like that they're just um, illusions. Hold on. I want this one right here. I don't know why. <laughs> no, I don't know why. Nine of Swords. So we go from the Ten of Wands to the Nine of Swords because you guys are not sleeping good, okay? Um, there's something that's... Something that's grounded in into your um, mind. And for some reason, you've got a lot of things that's going on. A lot of, of ideas, a lot of thoughts, a lot of... Um, stress honestly that you guys aren't sure about but I just want to say this you guys you guys your intuition and your knowledge and your business sense and and just your common sense as well will lead you to the right choices okay so try not to stress out too much about what am I supposed to do? How am I supposed to do it? Which way should I go? Is this the right decision? You know what I'm saying. We all go through it, you all. I'm not just picking on you. But it's just sometimes some things are out of your um, out of your hands or out of your control. And for some reason, you might just lay in bed at night and just think, 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 think. And sometimes you start stressing because you're overthinking things. So sometimes not always but sometimes when we just kind of roll with it kind of go with the flow it works out the best that, that you can even imagine and I'm kind of feeling like that with you all now I'm not saying don't do anything so don't take that the wrong way I'm just saying roll with it and for some reason don't stress out about it because things are going to work out in your favor. I just feel it. You've got this justice. You've got the death. Here comes a new situation, a change for you all. You've got the wheel of fortune saying it's just waiting for you guys to catch up so it can spin you into the next cycle. And in order to do that, you've got to complete something or finish something in this cycle. So you guys are on in the process of that right as we speak, I think. Here we go. Three of Cups celebrations, gatherings, friends, get-togethers. I see it as more of a celebration than anything, you all. Give me just a minute, okay? Let me look at these. So you've got the wheel, sell us new cycles. You've got the sun, 
tickled and you've got this three of cups which is you guys um, celebrating something so I have a feeling that there's going to be something that you guys are going to be thrilled about. I mean, you're going to be wanting to celebrate. And sometimes, you know, this is like you call your friends and say, Hey, meet me somewhere or come on over or you know, let's have a glass of wine or whatever it is. And it's just, the, you know, a, a few of you guys getting together because there's something important that's happened in your life. So sometimes this is about gatherings or get-togethers or, you know, high school reunions or something possibly too. But I just feel like that you guys, there's something here that you guys are going to want to celebrate. And that in itself gets me a little bit excited. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to stop there, you all. I think I might take one for that Seven of Cups over there. Let's see how that works out. Uh-oh. One at a time. Seven of Swords. Go from one seven to another. Hold on, you all. Let me look at these. You know, I was saying earlier about some of these um, cups right here feeling like they're illusions or they're too good to be true. And, and I just want you guys to be aware that sometimes they are too good to be true and they might be people trying to take advantage in one way or another. Sometimes the Seven of Swords can be somebody that is not really on the up and up, you know. Um, have you ever seen uh, a an ad in the paper or somewhere and it's it's give it says that they'll pay you of all kinds of money in, in a week's time and all this other stuff and the more you look into it the more you realize that they expect you to work you know every day of the week 10 12 14 hour days or the company's not really there it's just kind of maybe it's you know too good to be true or I almost feel like that some some of you all um, maybe realizing that some of these options are not good for you at this time but I also feel like that that the, with this seven of swords you get this justice card this could have been something that's happened in your past something that you guys haven't really um, got the closure to or got information on and now all of a sudden you may be getting some you may be gaining some sort of information or some sort of closure with something that's happened in your past I don't know why I'm saying that it may only be for a few of you all but for some reason I feel that way and maybe that's how you're spinning into a new cycle is because now you can actually say okay I can put that behind me and move forward let's take one more you all these cards, <laughs> they're everyone wanting to fly out. I don't know. This one. Seven of Wands. Do you guys see what I'm seeing? Seven, seven, seven. Hold on. Possibly with this Seven of Wands, you know, this is about you guys are... Um, defending yourself, you're defending your job, you're defending your home, your family, your situation, whatever this is. But maybe this is where, you know, you're, you're seeing something that's not uh, on the up and up and you guys are catching it and throwing it over your shoulder and you're defending what you know is right. Um, I just, you got three sevens here in a row. And in my mind, the sevens are, are good luck in different ways. First of all, you, you guys have already went over the hump, you know, the fives are, are the hump. And you guys are already coming down the other side with these sevens. There's nothing but going up from here in a good way. I don't mean the roller coaster. I mean, um, this is a good sign that you guys have, have gone through anything that's unnecessary and you guys are on, on the sevens. So it's only going to keep going eight, nine, you know, that thing. So I have a feeling that you guys are, are in the process of finishing something, um, you're defending what's important to you, and, there, and there's nothing going to stand in your way, honest to goodness. Let's take one more, you all, because justice is about to be served. <laughs> Page of Pentacles. Well, here comes a messenger to give you all something. 
here comes information, here comes news, here comes new opportunities. You guys are about ready to get something that's coming in that's going to give you uh, better options. And I really do believe that you guys are going to be thrilled with those options. You know, this particular page can be about finances. It can be about a new journey, a new adventure for you all. It can be about a, a new job or something regarding a new business opportunity. It can be, you know, all new projects. It can be uh, laying foundations. Um, it can go in different directions. But this particular page is about messages that are going to get you all excited. So here's a new cycle. Here's a new opportunity. Um, you guys are, went over this hump right here. And then here's the justice card. I just feel like you guys are on the path of getting something, creating something, maybe making something that is really going to put you over the top. And I believe that if you guys are on a little bit of a teeter-totter um, with this choose a new direction, I think with this death of a situation, with these new options that's coming in along with these options as well regarding your job or business or career and then looking at it this way you guys are going to be tickled with the way this works out for you i'm telling you you are with this sun card in the middle i mean that is the most beautiful card that we have so there's going to be a death of a situation it's going to be you guys working too much, you guys trying to uh, do too much, being pulled in too many different directions, you're burdened with something that's going on in your life, you're stressed out about it, but then you're going to be celebrating because there's going to be something else coming in. I also believe with this Two of Cups, you guys are going to, you and someone else are a partnership in, in different ways. Sometimes it's romantic, sometimes it's a best friend, sometimes it's a brother, sister, parent, child. Uh, family member and the two of you all I believe are going to bond together and 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 be uh, stronger than ever before and I believe it has something to do with a job or a career or a business opportunity um, when I see this share the love I, I, it makes me feel like that for some of you you guys may be in the process of helping commute your community or the people around you. Maybe it's people in your church. Maybe it's your neighbors. Um, maybe it's, you know, with free food or uh, donations in different ways. I don't know why. I just feel like that. Maybe that's just for a handful. But I do feel that way, you all. I feel like you guys are wanting to give back to people that may need it at this time. And I think that that in itself is going to make you all tickled. You know, sometimes it's not always about money, giving money to people that may need it. It's about just being um, kind and caring and considerate uh, to people that may need it in your community or in your um, environment. Or maybe it's in your city, in your state, you know, in your country. But I just feel like for some of you guys with this share the love, you guys are going to help other people in different ways. And I'm I'm tickled about that, you all, because something is coming to an end, and this is about change right here, and I do believe you guys are going to be moving in a new direction with new options right here, and I think you're going to be absolutely tickled with the way it works out. You're going to feel like justice will be served in one way or another, whether this is a court case or anything like that. It could just be about something that's happened to you in the past that you guys are going to get closure on or get information about and for some reason that's going to make you feel like okay now i can move on i now i can move forward now i I'm feel more balanced and i just think that it's going to put you in a happy place right here overall you all this is a beautiful reading don't let um these options bog you down if you've had someone that's not really on the up and up, I think that that is going to be like, they're going to, they're either going to get, they're going to get what they deserve. Okay, let's put it that way. That's how I feel about it. And then with the seven of, of wands, it's almost like you guys have keep having to defend, defend, defend. So maybe some of you guys are dealing with the court system in one way or another. Maybe it's regarding a child possibly with this page right here and you guys are, are in a court battle possibly 
um, and I think that it's going to work out in your favor, okay? If this is not a court case, I believe you're going to be getting a news or message or information or options that's coming in that you guys are going to be thrilled about, honest to goodness. So this is a beautiful reading, Leo. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. I think... Um, I think you and someone else are going to become stronger. I think you're going to want to celebrate by the end of this. And I think that <laughs> you're going to feel uh, tickled, uh, extremely, extremely tickled by it when it's all said and done with the way things are going to work out for you. And honestly, I think it's just going to kind of... Um, I think it's just going to kind of fall into place for you all in a lot of ways, okay? I'm not saying don't do anything. I'm just saying I think it's going to fall into place. All right, you all. I hope you guys enjoy this today. Please keep in mind if this does not resonate right at this moment, it may in the very near future. Sometimes it's right around the corner. Sometimes it's a little later on. Take care, you all. I'll see you soon.